Hey everybody, so it's been forever since I made a hair video and I know the last time I made a hair video I said it was going to be a lymph check but it wasn't a lymph check. Um, I was taking my hair out and I actually was wearing the same shirt. I think I just realized it but okay so I just wanted to make a quick video because the last couple videos I've made were like all depressing and about my mental illnesses and my eating disorders and a lot of crazy shit. So I actually just got finished taking my hair out of um, Two Strand Twists. I don't wear my hair out um, anymore. Ever since it hasn't been able to fit into a puff, I don't wear it out because I don't like it down for some strange reason. I don't like shit over my ears because I always feel like there's things going in my ears. So sorry if it's a little bit echoey because I'm in the bathroom, but all right, I'm just gonna start because I'm going to try to get a little bit close so you can see. And if you hear any scratching, that's just my cat trying to get in this freaking room and she can't get in here. So the very front of my hair. Oh, also, I've cut my hair recently. Um, I've been getting those single strand knots and every time I get a single strand knot, I just cut it out. And I'm kind of really tempted to do a big chop again. I am so sick of it. Like, I got my hair healthy. I feel like I got it healthy. I uh, it grew a lot. It grew back to what it was before I did the big chop from the relaxer. And now I'm just sick of it. I liked having the short hair. I never had short hair before in my life. And I liked it and I enjoyed it. And, I, and it was so easy to clean. And now it takes me almost two hours just to wash it in the shower. And that's with the fucking parting and shit. So. My cat's scratching at the door like really bad. So I just want to show you guys. Um, it is uh, 6. AC is about to come on. It is um, June 20 something, 2016. And I am how many years post relaxer? I will put it on the screen because I can't remember it right now. I might be five. It might be six, I don't remember. All right, so let's start. And, um, okay, so the very front. The very front. So, I don't remember the last time I even tried to do this. Oh, see, and I get a lot of shedding still to my face. All right, so, I don't know if I should go like that because um, let me move in a little bit. Focus on me thing. It feels like it's it's below my collarbone. It's definitely below my collarbone. Ow! And I'm trying not to use um, brushes and combs. So the last time I washed, I just used my hands and a, um, a, um, a really huge comb. I can't even, you know one of those shower combs. You know what I'm trying to say. And because I wanted the curls to clump because it was, I'm having trouble with frizz and it's not clumping into the parts like it should. There's certain pieces, like I don't know if you could see, you could see a little curl pattern. There's certain pieces that'll clump together. So let's just do this fucking shit, god damn it. Stop talking. It feels like it's almost here. Cause I got my shoulders down. Collarbone is here. So, and I don't want to push it up into my face because if I do that, then it comes to my neck and it's not really there. Where is it? Where is it? My collarbone. It is, I think it is about maybe an inch or a half inch below my collarbone. So it's kind of like right here when I pull it all the way down. And that's from the very top, of course. Um, let's do one right at the ear. Now, I have cut a lot more off of this side than I have this side lately. And I mean, I'm just going scissor crazy. I remember when I was first transitioning, and I don't know, some of you will remember when I was just like, fuck it, I was clipping here and there before I did the big chop. I was clipping everything always and forever. <laughs> and I feel like now I'm doing the same thing. I'm like, if I feel a knot, snip. I like snipped off a whole bunch not too long ago too so this month what is that i feel something here i don't like i don't want to part it too much so this is this is right above my ear this is hair right above my ear 
And this is my collarbone. You guys can't see it, but I feel it right there. This one is right below my collarbone also. And of course it was longer and I cut it. Where's the collarbone? So maybe an inch below my collarbone? I don't fucking know. It's almost to the arm. It probably was at the armpit before I fucking uh, cut it off. And let's do one on the top. Cause I cut a lot off. I mean, I cut a lot off, guys. You could. There's a lot of uneven parts in here. I don't know if you see. Let's do this side. Cause I know each side is different. Actually, this one's right above my ears. Now this one should be shorter. Should be shorter from um, the other side because this side I find is a lot drier and it's been drier. And I've talked about this in videos from years ago about this side of my head being drier than this side. Like the cuticle on this side, close. Look at this, this I just took out. Um, I just took out, I just took this out from a, um, a twist and I did, um, can you see it more that way? I don't know. I took it out and I didn't uh, unravel it much. And I don't know if you can see how the cuticle is closed. Excuse the pimples on my face. The cuticle is very nicely closed on this piece of hair. Of course, there's straggles. But this side, you can, you can see this side too. It's like so dry and I hate it. I hate it so much. And it's been years. And I do the same thing to that side that I do to this side. So it makes no sense. All right, let's pull this one out. Let's try not to rip any knots out, Asia. Because I like to rip the knots out. I ripped something out right there. I just felt it. I just heard it. Ah, come on. There's little knots here. See now, when I, if I feel shit like this, when I feel shit like that, I cut that shit off. Like later on today, I'm probably gonna cut it off. I feel it right there. So this shot should be, yeah, it's a lot shorter, isn't it? Is it a lot shorter? My collarbone. That's the bottom of my collarbone. Here's the top of it. Is that yeah that one is up here? It seems like everything is a little bit maybe an inch, a half to an inch lower than my collarbone. In the back, you let's do just a, a walk around really quick so you guys can see. So you can see. It's been so long. I haven't been taking care of it the way I was at the beginning of my journey. I just said fuck it. Once it reached the uh, the length it was before I uh, big chop my hair, I was just like fuck it. Some some of my back pieces, I feel. God, where is it that? I'm gonna get right in the middle. There's a piece right in the middle that's always been long, but I did cut it recently. I cut my whole hair. Let's just I cut my whole head. Oh, piece of hair on me. Is this? Let's see if I can reach that. Cause usually I can. Oh, did you hear that? <laughs> I'm touching something. All right, let's see. Hopefully you can see this. This feels like it's at my bra, the top of my bra strap. And I'm gonna lift my head up a little bit more and it's still, that's the top of my bra strap, it's right there. <sighs> that felt good though, I like the stretch. So anyway, I never wear my hair late. I moved to California and I feel like, you know, when you move somewhere new, people don't know you, so you can wear your hair differently. Mm -hmm. You could do a lot of different stuff differently, but I still haven't had the confidence to wear my hair out. I actually did wear my hair out one time before. I had bought some curl formers. I should have made a video about it. Um, look at this. I should have made a video about it, but I feel like there's a bunch of videos on here already, you know? Who am I? I am just a little girl, not a little girl, a whole little YouTuber who has been making videos about a bunch of things, not just hair, but it seems like people like me talk about hair, but I don't, I don't know how to do it still. It's been, what, five years? I have to pull this out, guys. 
It's been five years since I've been learning how to do it and I still don't know how to do it. You tell me what the hell that's about. I don't fucking know. Now, what is this? I like that the last time I washed it, uh, there's crinkles, crinkles. There's a curl pattern, you can see. I'm real tempted. This don't feel right. It feels scraggly. Can you see this piece of hair? It feels real scraggly. I want to cut that. I want to cut it so bad. Or at least the ends. And this one, can you see that? I'm going to cut this later too. Because it's this one's coming down a little bit further. But I'm like, I hate it. I want to get rid of it, guys. I want to get rid of it. I am done. I'm done with the hair journey. I feel I made it to where I feel I need to be. There you go. And I'm happy now. Um, my hair is healthy for the most part and I don't need to do any more. I mean, I probably will do more because I always, I just like making videos and it's good just to have, um, you know, things to talk about because I'm sick of talking about mental health shit all the goddamn time. I should start talking about my hair again. Maybe I can try and start wearing it out. You know what? I just realized there's a mirror right here. I look fatter in the camera. So that shit is really is true that the camera puts weight on you. I cannot believe it. I didn't believe it, but it's, it's true. All right, I gotta go because I gotta stew on the stove and I'm hungry. Okay, thank you guys for watching. I'm gonna try to start making videos again. I don't do much with my hair anymore, as you guys can see. I just usually wash it and then I'll put it in a two strand twist and when the twist gets old, and I'll wear it like that. When the twist gets old, I just, I'll take it out and I wash it again and I put it in twist again. So that's basically how I've been wearing my hair for like the past couple of years. So thank you again for being subscribed and liking my videos. I appreciate it. I like when you guys uh, watch my videos. Not that they're interesting at all because there's really some things I really want to talk about, but not in this video. And I say that every time. Okay, I'm gonna go.